Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Bazaar. Last episode we did a bunch of side quests and oh my goodness one dude would just not shut up. He spoke for so long. We got attacked by um, the owners of the Beehive Bar and we came here and just um, yeah couldn't really do much. Uh, I guess maybe we'll come back and do a bit more later on but we've got a side quest we need to figure out how to do which is at the King's Pond. We continue going through the swamp to get to Straight City, which I think is just the exit right there. We are very weak. Very weak because uh, when we got attacked, the dude had guillotine on his um, pincer. And he did not miss four times in a row. He got us with guillotine. And I almost lost. It was lucky that our Crobat got flinched twice in a row. Oh, there's the gym leader, so we'll go speak to him in a little bit. Um, hi. So I was told that this was a good place to swim, but I'm not too sure now. Okay. I only spoke to him because I wasn't sure if it was a battle or not, and um, yeah, like I said, very weak. Uh, oh no. Well, that's not great. Alright, now that we're fully healed, <laughs> let's uh, take this dude out. And we can continue exploring the swamp and make our way to Straight City, and you're gonna burn me! Great! Hey, we got the paralysis at least. That burn really sucks. I'm pretty sure I've got a full heal or a burn heal I can use. I picked up quite a few berries, so maybe we've got a berry that can heal us. Right, let's check. Please say I do. Burn heal. Fantastic. All right. All good. And mm, anything that's got like a, oh, I haven't got like a normal potion or a super potion. I've oh, got fresh water. That'll do. I don't really want to waste like a a strong healing item. I need a little bit of HP. Let's go in here. There's a guy with a among us need to speak to, but I have a special mushroom treatment that will make your Pokemon freak out. Uh, sure. He heals us up! No! I didn't know! See, like new! Oh man! Oh, I could've just got healed up there. I walked past him a couple of times and I was thinking, oh, I'll fight you in a little bit. I could've just healed up there. I didn't know. Oh, that's so annoying. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Now we know. And if we need to heal up again, we can go back and talk to him. Uh, let's switch out. Actually, she's going to switch you out as well. Into cast form, and then we'll switch out and go into... Uh, let's go into accordion. And we'll go for uproar. Oh, you're going to blizzard me. That's fine. That Ledian's getting so strong. Uh, Shinonic, stay in, keep uproaring. All good, all good. You got another one? Or is that it? I think you. Yep, another one. Swallow! This accordion is so sick. So sick! Keep going. No! Hey! Okay, I need to get rid of the point. Actually, I'm about to say, use an antidote or something. Let's go walk back and talk to this guy and get healed up. <laughs> Sweet. I also, I, I've took on off the repel bracelet so we can get some encounters and hopefully find some new stuff. There's the pseudo widow. Uh, I'm gonna try and catch this. Just curious to see what type it is. I think it's rock fighting, I want to say. I could be wrong. Should I try Great Ball? Nice. Alright, what type are you? Oh, we've got my Pokedex, so I won't show up, will it? We'll find out when we get to the box. Uh, we'll talk to you in a second. I'm gonna go explore down here. Inkey! Which we don't need. I haven't been down this bit, so let's go check, see what we can find. Ooh! Wait. Oh, is this, um... Oh! Oh, wait! There's tacos! That's Waluigi! That's the side quest! Let's go and do this. Uh, hi! Wah! A customer? Finally! Well, you living under a rock? No one ever uh, comes through here. Since I wasn't accepted to Smash Bros, I have to make a living somehow, so I decided to start selling tacos. My tacos can't be beat. My prices are great. Good, nice and cheap. However, I drew up a plan that would uh, help me sell much more. The key is to learn necromancy. Legend has it that a master of tacos once lived in Quintellus. If I could just revive him, the taco monopoly would be mine. With that, I need your help. Legends say that an ancient book of black magic is hidden at the top of the tower in Dark Forest. So I need that book. The bad thing is that I can't abandon my post. That's why I need you as a partner. In exchange, I will give you discounts on my tacos. 
Oh, speaking of business, do you want anything? Uh, the Waluigi Talker. Revise a fainted Pokemon. Uh, yeah, we'll get we'll get two. Right. So we need to go to the Dark Tower. Well, the Tower in the Dark Forest, right? Is that the tower we went to when we first saw the ACP member? Like over here? Yeah, Dark Forest. Okay, so we got a long way to go to get this done. But the Braviaries should be just, yeah, here. Right, so let's, uh, I always talk to the Braviari, I think I talked to that little bit there. So let's go this way to Zeppelin City. Then we'll just head west. Love getting these side quests done, man, it's so fun. Right, the, uh, it's a stone walk. I'm trying to remember how to get through here easy. I think it was just down like this, yeah? We have Rock Smash, don't we? Yes, we do. And there are the Dark Forest. No, not Route 2. Dark Forest is down? Is this the Dark Forest or have I gone a different way? There you go, Dark Forest. It's getting a little bit lost. It feels like so long ago we were here. Alright, so the top of the tower is a book. Good thing is that everything around here has already been explored, so it should be a straight run up. Oh. Hey, Duskull, just gonna run away. Don't wanna fight anyone. We all good. Ooh. Okay, yeah, I can see two items there. So do we miss these items then? Oh. I must have missed these before. My bad. I mean, it's good we can get them now. There's a TM as well. I thought like, I went down all the, the spots before, but clearly I did not. I know I got some of them. Because behind there is that bit there, so I guess I never went down this one, which should take us to the TM. Fantastic. Will-O-Wisp. Honestly, not bad. Alright, now we make our way to the top. Oh, dude, these, these like cloud dust, I swear, sometimes they purposely just move to get in my way. That's what it feels like. Alright, so I'm pretty sure after this one... Right, this one here's the last one. I think. Ooh. So this is the last one. Ooh. Uh, hi. So Driftblim pounces on you. Oh, the music's creepy. Level 56, okay. Uh, Thunderbolt, and we'll go... Fairy Fist? Oh, don't be minimizing. Yep. I say, oh my god, you are strong. Okay, this is gonna be tough. Yep, keep missing. So good, so good. Oh man, I don't know if I'm gonna do this. We've got the revive, which is good. Uh, Crobat. Thunder. F Actually, let's go for a Screech. I'm gonna U turn. This Lydian's never gonna land an attack, man. Oh, landed it, nice. Okay, now I'm gonna go into Sun Floor. I wanna go for this before you go for any more um, uh, minimizers. If you do, that could be really bad. We've got the leaf seed off. Okay, so now we can definitely win. We'll go Thunder Fang, and we'll just go the shield to stop you from killing us. Pro bat, okay. Defense is down a lot, so one physical attack will kill you, hopefully. We ain't got anything super effective, so Ooh, this is bad. It's gonna go for a bullet punch in case. Hey, actually, yeah, only the attack, nice. Give me a little bit of damage, but yeah, it's better than nothing. That will seed. Oh, I'm so glad I landed it. Lava boy, uh, incinerate. I think Lava Plume hits my Pokemon on my team, right? We should finish off next time. 
Whew. Okay, that was a tough fight, man. That drift level was powerful. So Drift Blim has vanished. Oh, poor Drift Blim. Spent so long protecting the site. Uh, hi, Ghost. My name is Gundam. I used to be known as the Strategist. That was a few hundred years ago. It's been a long time since anyone has been here. Everyone was frightened by Drift Blim. Truth be told, I get it. It's not a Pokemon you want to come across out of the blue. Have you come for the Grimorium? Ah, <laughs> it's a little treasure. At the time, I wrote down everything I knew about black magic in it. I used it to take on Emperor Koska. It was quite a fun battle. There really wasn't much mystery to my strategy. I just pretended I knew how to do black magic. The rest of the weird stuff has, was done by a couple of ghost Pokemon and a few few psychics. I simply had Drifloon load up with Muna and fly over the army to spray them with some dream smoke. They took a good nap. Well, I'm going off on a ramble then. Uh, do you want my Grimorium? Yeah, I do. I think it's about time someone put it to good use. Remember. It doesn't really work. It's all a matter of believing in it, believing it, and making other people believe it. Take good care of it. Okay, cool. Well, see you around. Thanks for paying me a visit. I'm usually pretty lonely. Oh, that's sad. Right, so. Let's get out of here and then we go back to Waluigi. <laughs> we can go and um, get the best tacos ever. Broken my legs, but it's not a big deal. <laughs> Right, uh, the fastest way back. Ooh, I don't know how we go about this. I think, depends where this takes us. Oh, Zeppelin City, so there should be a Breviary around here somewhere, right? There, there you go, take that. Fantastic. And then we're gonna go back to Route 6. Probably should have healed up first, actually, that would have been the smart thing, but I can get healed up by the dude in the um, in the swamp. Ah, that's it, bring it! Okay, let's go. Now the taco empire will be mine. Take this as a thank you. The Howlucha taco, thank you. What, did you think I was gonna give you a discount on my tacos? No way, Waluigi time. If you wanna buy tacos, you know where I am. Okay. Uh, is that it? That can't be it, right, surely? I didn't get the achievement though. Did I? No. I? Okay. Uh. Just looking. So you're not gonna. Okay, I get one of each, but. Maybe we'll see you again later on. I mean, that's like the first part of it. Okay. That was odd. At least that's part of the side quest though. And we'll see you later on with the ultimate taco made and we'll see what we get, but let's get some berries. I wanna get fully healed before I speak to the Jimmy to just in case something happens there. Like an ACP member shows up and we go into a fight or something. So if we just jump down this way, we're back to the start, we go around here. And then we talk to you, get fully healed, and now we can finally start making our way through the forest. Yeah, battled you, so let's talk to you. Oh, Voltsy, it's you. I was heading to Straight City when I ran into this little Murkrow. I think he ate a poisonous mushroom and got poisoned. It's not the first time I've come across something like this. Besides, I know quite a bit about mushrooms, believe it or not. <laughs> hey, don't look at me like that. It's not what you think. I know someone who had problems with them. There's a bar east of the forest. They have a special recipe that will help the little Murkrow. Can you go get it? Well, I stay and stay and take care of him. Okay, so now, yeah, we're supposed to go here, then we go to the bar, which obviously, yeah, I thought something had to happen at the bar because it just felt too, I don't know, empty when we were, were there. Like, nothing really happened after the whole event of fighting the uh, the bar keepers. But yeah, let's go and get this special recipe. Uh, yo, oh, you finally came. To be honest, okay. Uh. Good thing Samira is working hard to keep the business going. She said she'd bring in some money, but her business doesn't seem to be taken off. Uh, oh, our special recipe? You have good taste, my friend. It'll cost 5,000 poker dollars. We get a discount, do you accept? Yeah, sure. So, Yellow, one order of the special recipe coming up. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm not a crook. <laughs> Music, man. 
Uh, here you go, it's freshly made. Got the special recipe, thank you very much. If you want uh, Tortunian food, you know where to find us. The food hidden from us by the turtles that rule our society from the center of the earth. <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh my god, this game. It's just... It's just... It's just so... <laughs> it's... Oh... It's just... For, for what this game is, and uh, how silly it is, it's surprisingly just very good, but uh, do you have the recipe? Here, I'll take care of it. Hmm, come on, you should be fine by now. Run along now, and don't let me see you eating one of those things again. Well, we can continue. I'll be waiting for you in Straight City. Okay. Uh... Nothing down there. Ooh, item. Got some zinc. So we're about to go to the city now. Finally made it. Ooh, I like the, the buildings, but um... Joshua, if you go straight ahead and then go to the right, you'll see a house that isn't abandoned looking. A friend of mine should be inside. You can wait there with them while I wait for Voltsy. You might as well get out of the rain. Hmm? That way to the right. Okay, okay, I'll keep going. Hey, yo. Oh, you're already here. If I knew that, I would have told Joshua to wait. Well, well, welcome to Straight City. It's not very welcoming, to be honest. Right now, it's abandoned. Uh, now it's just me and a couple of roommates. We're in charge of maintaining the city and collecting documents so that they aren't lost in the an uh, annals of history. It's a city with a lot of backstory, you know? But it had a bit of dramatic ending, to be honest. See all this purple grass? Well, it all happened a few years ago. <gasps> Flashback. This drink? It's making me feel dizzy. Are you drunk? Yeah, maybe too drunk. <laughs> hey, can't find my marine biology books. Let's go, where are, where are they? Uh, no idea. But whatever, you shouldn't read those books anyway. I can hear something outside. Can we go and see what's going on? Uh, yeah, you're right. I can hear a lot of people. If you want, if you want, we can go out for a minute. Guys, uh, Eva and I are going for a walk. Don't make a mess. Come on, let's go. All right, then there, uh, there was what happened in the square. Let's just say there was an accident. So come and see, come and see. Today you're about to observe the greatest breakthrough in science in the history of mankind. The invention that will solve one of the biggest problems of our society. Could it be that he's talking about the wearable blanket they advertise on the teleshopping channel? No, you're redneck. I'm sure he's talking about that super useful uh, hose that you can take with you wherever you go. Don't we have that hose? But um, I'm afraid you're both wrong. It's something much more advanced. Could you be talking about the vacuum 3000? I'm talking about the wonderful art of teleportation. Oh, teleportation? Is that even possible? Holy Arceus, forgive us, that's impossible. Well, it would be nice to be able to go down to the bar without having to go down the stairs. <laughs> hush, hush, let me uh, show you right now. Come on, Bronzong. As you can see, this is a portal that can allow us to travel across dimensions. Using this portal, we'll be able to uh, move between different coordinates of our own dimension. It's true. Look, at, look, a portal appeared. My ticket to ultimate laziness. Stop this foolishness. Ugh, men. Uh, and can we use it now? Has it been tested? Let's see. Ooh, it's so shiny. No, wait, that's dangerous. Eva, get away from there. Huh? Oh. Wait, sir, be careful. What's this? Oh. He, he disappeared. Please get away from that portal right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Stop it right now. More portals have appeared. Here's more. Uh-oh. I can't make it stop. What's going on here? Is all oh, that the Interpoc agent? Um, yeah, look, my goodness, what is this? Quickly, we have to evacuate the city. What's going on, Stain? We have to evacuate everyone. Quickly, everyone head for the entrance of the city. No, no, wait, this shouldn't be happening. So eventually, portals appeared all over the city. From then, uh, began to emerge these strange plants that now cover the, cover the ground. It took the work of many scientists over many years to close them all. People had to be moved to Queen City, but there wasn't room for everyone. So, Despacito City was created. By the time the situation began to improve, people had already begun to settle into their new homes. After this, Interpoc uh, severely restricted all scientific experiments involving the use of Pokemon. But by the time they did, this research had already caught the attention of many. And this brings us to what happened at the Queen City Museum. Anyway, we live in a house uh, down the street to the right. Joshua should be waiting there, so I'll see you there. That fateful day. Okay, so anything we can find in here before we go to the house? Nothing in the trash. Ooh! 
Right, candy, let's go, baby. So I think all these houses probably can't go in. Is this the house we need to go into? Yeah. Hey, Voltsy. I was talking to Joshua, and since he was the first to arrive, he'll fight me first. Don't worry, Voltsy, I'll be quick. And you accuse me of being high. Well, look who's talking. Indiana, if you spend all day gallivanting around the region, how do you expect Trinus to have any respect for you? <laughs> hey. Anyway, follow me, Joshua. Let's go to the church. Come on, come on, come on. Let's kick some ass. These Pokemon won't prove their worth on their own. An impeccable strategy. You'll see, I'll tell you. That's so. I'll just have to uh, wait and see. Hope you didn't get rusty. No worries, Syndra. Like a good mystery, my Pokemon and I will unravel all of Joshua's strategies and turn this battle upside down. Uh, so I'm Syndra. I help Indiana work, uh, work with her in the city. Don't have much to offer you, really. If you want, we can uh, sit, sit for a while while you wait. Okay. But it's been a good day, hasn't it? Actually, it sucks. It's always raining. Mm. Ten minutes later. So you're from Beetletown? Hm. Didn't even know it existed, to be honest. Don't you have anything to say? I got nothing. Nothing interesting really happens here. Well, the other day I was drinking some tea that I had prepared for myself. Wait, did I prepare it or did it come bold? Hmm. What would be the point of buying bottled tea when you can make your own? Hmm. Well, when all of a sudden... Uh, I forgot. <laughs> this is awkward. Uh, hey, one thing. My partner, Zen Tefiko, is in a lab we have to the northeast. At the end of the city on the right. We have a PC and a machine that can heal your Pokemon. So it might come in handy. Might be good for you to check it out. Okay, we'll do. Just gonna check up here first, anything we can steal. Ooh, TM. Power up punch, nice. Can't open the safe. Uh, nothing there, wait. Just gonna double check, can I try it with this like document stuff? Right, oh, there's a door here. Don't think you're interested in going to the bathroom. Ah, oh, man, I might need, a, might need a number two, you never know. <laughs> Alright, so let's explore the rest of this city. That leads out, uh, so there's the lab. We can fly, there's the gym. Full restore, okie dokie. Alright, let's go to the lab first. Get healed up and check the pseudo -wudo. Uh, hi. If you're gonna mess around in the lab, could you at least not bother me? I have enough to do with uh, having to organize all this, please. Oh hell, you're not Indiana. It's just that Indiana and another boy were messing around here for a while. I don't know why. Are you also going to challenge Indiana? I have a PC and a machine that can heal your Pokemon. Feel free to use them. Oh, what the hell's going on now? It came from the church. Can you go check it out? Oh, I guess I can. Let's get healed up first. I also want to check this pseudo wudo out, see what type it is. I'm going to say rock fighting. Yeah, rock fighting. Okay. I'm coming down. Oh, help, I'm trapped. Sounds like the screams are coming from over there. Uh, my goodness, I don't even know where I am. I'm gonna hurl. Where's my boat? Right, what's down here? It's not time to go this way, you have to go see what's going on. Oh, man! Uh, yeah. Oh, you managed to unbolt the door. Bolts, you open the door. Quick, something very serious has happened. What the? Faulty, we had already finished our battle when suddenly some stones fell on the Indiana. We had to go find her assistance. What, what happened to her? Oh my lord, I asked you, she can't be. My boat, it, it was stolen. Who the hell is this dude? Oh, I thought he was your friend. He was right out front. I've never seen him in my life. I don't know where I am, but this is very strange. Indiana was in charge of maintaining this church. How is it possible that the roof collapsed? I suggest we look into this. Something about this is bothering me. Alright, everyone, it's time. Finally, something exciting has happened in my life. Been waiting for this moment for a long time. Uh, are they dead? Uh, a stone below and above Indiana? Okay. Right. Folks, I swear I have no idea what happened. Nina was about to give me the badge when all of a sudden all the candles went out. I couldn't see anything. I tried to get out of the door, but it was blocked. I shouted to see if anyone was close by. When I screamed, the candles lit up again and I saw Indiana lying there. Then you came in and burst through the door like a madman. You know the rest. It's a real bummer, bro. Okay, got your alibi. Oh, okay, so we've got to, uh... Turn the locked door. Murder mystery, sort of thing. So 
So ask what she was doing. Uh, well, we talked for a bit and then you went to see Zen. And I was in the bathroom when the scream happened. What, doesn't that sound convincing? It's like I had more important things to do. Okay, so we got your alibi. Uh, ask the clues. When I said something seems strange, I wasn't joking. Joshua said the roof broke, but if you look up, nothing appears to be broken. The roof is perfect, there's not a scratch on it. Then where did these rocks come from? Okay. Uh, what are you doing? My goodness. I was just looking for my boat, and now I'm stuck in this mess. I don't know uh, how I ended up here. I was looking for my boat, and I saw two people walking around. I tried to ask them about my boat, then they ran away without paying any attention to me. Okay. Uh, also clues. I don't know anything. I just know that I still have some goods left on my ship. Okay. Well, I'll leave that for now. Uh, let's talk to you. Hmm. Don't know anything about this. I was just working. I can't even call it that. I kept uh, getting distracted. How can I work with everyone coming and going from the lab? First Indiana and the other guy said they were looking for something and then you and now this. Can't get anything done here. Right, we know you're probably innocent because you're with us. But ask for clues. I was looking around and I thought it was strange that this door was open. Normally it's always closed. We don't know where it leads. Okay, the secret door. Let's go through here. Where is this taking us? Oh. Okay. So this takes us here. Uh. We go back in. So you said the same thing. I don't know what we want to be doing. So I've spoken to everyone. Let's go to the right of town then? Because we didn't explore over here. Maybe the person that did whatever ran away this way? So the cemetery. Oh. Oh, okay, wow. Well, Waluigi's here! So I finally have all the preparations ready. Now it's my turn to use uh, what I've learned with the Grim Grimorium. Uh, I did it! Who the hell dares wake me up from my long slumber? It's a spirit tomb! I must peacefully rest in my wonderful tomb. It's you! Ah! The master of tacos, I've done it! With your power, the taco empire will be mine. My tacos? Oh, I see. You're a man of culture. I can't refuse a body that seeks the wisdom of tacos. Wait, what are you doing? Oh. Possessed him. But help! Oh, so you have a little friend here. I'll take care of them. This vessel feels good. Let's see what, what its power level is. Come here. This moment will uh, revive my taco empire. Okay, so this is continue on the side quest. <laughs> uh, let's just run the bolt the Harucha. Oh, you're so weak. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. You missed that high jump kit, that was so clutch. Uh, let's go Bullet punch ya. Nice. Spirit, I want the spirit tomb. Oh, type your eyes with a fairy fist, you might- Nope, you're not dark. You're not very effective. Right. Let's try a punch. Got a crit in there. Hit five times and four times, got the flinch, nice. Try bullet punch. Flinch again, sick. Go on. Go on, son! Flinch again. Ah. Oh. Maybe you're fire. Hmm. I think you're fire something then. And we've our last one. I can stay in. Very fists. Oh, that icicle crash though. Go accordion. I'll draw ya. I did a, a lot more than I was thinking it was gonna do, so I'm gonna probably die here. Unless. Oh man. We lived that attack, we've been so clutch. Come on, just gotta get this lava plume off and we win. Oof. That was a tough fight, man. Uh, pedal blizzard? Nah, no, I'm good. 
Well then. <laughs> ah, I finally got you. No, no, wait. Now you're coming with me. Let's create the ultimate taco. Hey, I'm not your slave. Okay, so I guess we now go back to the taco truck. Okay. Uh, is there anything else we want to do around here? I don't. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing, but I think I'll go back to the. I'll get healed up first, and then we. We'll, wait, what if we go to the bathroom? That bathroom was kind of suspicious. Oh wait, there's something in the trash there. Wait, it's really. Oh, it's the stones actually. It's really light. It's in a cardboard. Huh, cardboard stones. Interesting. Let's go check out the house. It's a bottle of mosto, it must be good. Okay, key items. So can we go in here? Doors into the bathroom. But there's definitely some clues around here. Iron bars. They're the same as those used to block the church door. Oh. Whose room is this? Don't know whose room who belongs to who, but uh, maybe now we've got this evidence, we can go back and say what we think. Because there's nothing else to explore. Can't get into that house there. Uh, let's go and check. Ah, all right, it's time to talk. Come here, everyone. So what happened? I don't know. Shouldn't we ask Joshua? He was the only one with her, right? What, me? I told you, I don't know anything. Everything suddenly went dark and I didn't see anything. I just know that the roof suddenly fell in. That may be the uh, noise that Volty and I heard in the laboratory. Yeah, yeah, it's, but it's impossible for the roof to have collapsed because... This is a message to Toro. You will now have to select any evidence you have uh, saved in the key. Objects back to prove your point. Good luck. Right. So. Uh... Though it appeared that the roof had collapsed, it was in perfect condition. So let's... Are we saying this first? Because they're saying about the roof. See, the roof isn't broken. It hasn't collapsed or anything like that. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It must have been my imagination then. I don't believe him. Maybe it's because I'm sobering up, but he sounds suspect. Joshua, are you sure you didn't see anything? I'm telling you no, I was here for the whole time. The door was locked from the outside. I couldn't do that. Hmm, and who's this guy? Who are you? I've never seen you before in my life. I just sail through life, you know? Damn, this is so confusing. So how do you explain the pile of stones that cla collapsed on Indiana? What if they didn't collapse? I think the rocks didn't fall on Indiana. And that's because, uh... Pile of color stones that were in the lab. Are we seeing the cardboard stones? They didn't fall. I'm gonna say the cardboard stones? Hmm. I'm just thinking like, because the, the roof didn't collapse, that, would that be the bit that we have to say about the roof? I'm gonna say cardboard stones. Wait, uh... Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. What if the stones didn't collapse, the rocks didn't fall on Indiana? Because... Okay, so the roof was definitely the right thing to say then first. I, 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 do I say the roof again then? Wait, the stone, there were stones under the body. Of course, the rocks had fallen on Indiana, there would be no rocks underneath her. So this is enough to prove that nothing fell on poor Indiana. I guess, I don't know, you guys are the smart ones here. Don't give me a hard time, I only came here to fight. What confuses me now is, the stones could not have made it this far on their own. And everyone that says they weren't around here, so... One of us is lying. No, I never lie, Your Honor. I'm not lying either, I was working the whole time. Worst it was Joshua and Indiana walked to the lab. Then Volty came and we heard someone scream. What are you saying, you saw Joshua and Indiana? That contradicts one of the statements. Oh wait, okay. Joshua was locked in the church and could not get out at any time, so he... Uh... Sort of leaving. 
So he was working the entire time, Joshua and India stopped by the lab. Mm. So we, oh, which one are we going to go for? I don't think it matters if we get it wrong, but they, if they were locked in. So he never left this place, but Zen claims to have seen you. With Indiana no less? Well, that would be when we stopped by there before the fight, and so Indiana could pick up some potions, that's all. Oh, okay, yeah. That was only a few minutes before Volti came in. The fight should have been over by then. What? I guess you could have mixed up the time? You do look drunk. You guess? Joshua, do you have your badge? Of course. Uh, what do you take me for? I almost always win. Almost. But if you were at the lab before the fight, you wouldn't have had enough time to finish it in time. I spent with Volti. I was trying to confuse us. I couldn't get out. The door was locked. What if there was another way to exit? Yeah, the secret door. Uh, secret door. Of course, a secret passageway. The what? Passageway. You could have went through the passageway. But you have no proof I used it. I didn't go through the passageway. But you did go out, didn't you? Yeah, he did come out. Out of there. Uh... So would this be... The sailor's alibi because he saw them two coming out? Two we went out? Through the church door. Wait, they wouldn't tell me where I was? My boat. So, and where did they go? The starboard. The starboard of the church. Don't know who starboard is, but I'm sure as hell didn't go with him. So you went out the church door. So it was not closed. I... Then you went to the laboratory. And what would you do in the lab? Nothing. They came for something. What were they looking for? Uh... The cardboard stones? Stones made from cardboard? Oh wait, cardboard? You're telling me those stones are made of cardboard? Why did you mention this before? I knew something had, uh, someone had taken them. And why would we want to take some cardboard stones? Doesn't make any sense. Hmm. So what's wrong? I remember something. That boy, he did something in front of the church door. What? Uh, what would I do in front of the church? In front of the church, uh... Doors off from the outside when you arrived at the church. Okay. I think he locked the door. But did you block the door with cardboard stones? Even I wouldn't be do a, do a stupid thing like that. Well, it's true that I tried. Then you really did lock the door. Well, so what? Is it a crime to lock a door? But why did you lock the door? It's very suspicious. Let's see, it is not known if I closed the door or not? What did I close it with if I only had some cardboard stones, according to you? The... Iron bars. Who could use those iron bars? Those iron bi bars were at home and I was there. It's possible for anyone to enter without being seen. Uh, I was getting bored and I'm sure if anything unusual was going on, I would have noticed. But based on what we've told you, you may not have realised. Uh... Since I was talking to you, then went to the bathroom. Right? Say someone came in while I was in the bathroom? Yes. They got everything they needed. Did you sneak in with Indiana? Anyway, okay, okay, you got me. Went in with Indiana, we got what we needed, locked the door from the outside and entered the church through the passageway. Why is Indiana covered in blood and lying on the floor? Don't tell me that's actually... Uh... Mosto. Well, that's it. It's Mosto. What do you mean, Mosto? <laughs> Every puzzle has a solution. It was all Joshua and me. Wasn't it interesting? Interesting, you nearly gave me a heart attack. Oh well, I had a great time. Ah, turned out well in the end, eh, Indiana? Yeah, the truth is that I didn't know if faking my death was going to be a great idea. <laughs> but we did well, didn't we? Well, oh Lord Arceus, please get these crazy people away from me. But why? That's what I don't understand. I don't really have a normal gym and because of that, uh, there aren't any prior challenges before facing me. It seemed like a bummer to me and Indiana came up with this idea to try with Volti. Hm, where's my sailboat? And where'd you get this man? That's right, Joshua, who the hell is that? I have no idea whatsoever, I found him outside. My head is spinning. Um, well, I guess it's time for our battle, Volti. Let me know whenever you want to have it. Okay, uh... That was kind of cool, not gonna lie, but... Right now, I'm gonna go and finish this side quest. And, uh... Go down to Route 6. Go and speak to Waluigi and have the ultimate taco. And hopefully, we get this. Oh, Spirit Tomb. Ah, it's you, welcome. I got the ultimate taco business. I suppose you uh, have also contributed something to this. 
but just a little bit. Take this. Spectral taco. The rest won't come for free. What does this do? Boost a special attack if the bearer does not know status of tanks. Okay. I have nothing more to teach him. Please, could you hit me with you? <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get a free spirit tomb. Nice. Uh, yeah, let's add it to the team. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of the... I like the chat up, but I think I'm gonna get rid of it for the time being. Because the spirit tomb just seems a lot stronger. Right, so. I think it's probably a great place to uh, end this part off. Next episode, we will go take on the gym leader. And then after that, I think we're probably going to go for the, the icy puzzle. Uh, the mountain, which is going to be really fun. But yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Let's quickly just check the spirit tomb out. Just double check. Oh, it's holding something. Level 50. Ghost fire. Flash fire. Shadow ball, flame burst, swagger, pain split. Cool. Right, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Let's make sure we save the game just in case something bad happens. I'll catch you guys next time. We'll go get the fifth gym badge. Peace.